President Biden has just unveiled his budget for the 2025 fiscal year. And the gist of it is provide more financial support for 98% of American households while raising taxes on corporations and the wealthiest, like 1.8%. It's a 188 page plan. So let's just take a look at some of the highlights with regards to families. The budget outlines a plan to expand the child tax credit. Uh, so not only increase the amount of money back per child, but make those benefits available in like monthly installments if you don't wanna receive it all as a lump sum during tax season. The budget also proposes a national paid family and medical leave program. Currently, we do not have a paid program. We just have FMLA, which is unpaid 12 weeks. And it would also expand access to this FMLA program um, to everybody, even parents whose jobs don't currently qualify them. The budget also calls for a new program that would guarantee access to reliable, low-cost childcare uh, from birth until kindergarten for families making less than 200K per year. Now I know what you're thinking, how is this gonna be funded? So implementing a billionaire minimum tax of 25%, solidifying a 21% minimum corporate tax rate, and increasing the tax on stock buybacks. There are no tax increases in the plan for families making less than $400,000 per year. I mean, the only way forward is for corporations to finally pay their fair share, and that's exactly what Biden's new budget hopes to kickstart. Follow Gainer Newsroom for more.